Despite a strong lead from Wall Street, the Aussie market had a rough start with the ASX 200 dipping over 1% and hitting five week lows in the morning session. We did bounce back in the afternoon though, pairing losses to finish the session down only 11 points or 0.2%. The material sector again weighed on the index with Rio and BHP struggling after a drop in iron ore prices this week. The big winner though was the travel sector after the federal government announced a $1.2 billion package to support the tourism industry. Webjet and Flight Center were two of the best performers for the day. In Forex, the US dollar continues to weaken against other majors as a mild CPI figure was announced overnight and bond yields continue to fall after a successful 10-year note option last night. This gave a boost to the Aussie dollar, which is now trading around 77.5 cents. UK and European futures are indicating a positive open with DAX futures up around 50 points and FTSE 20 from yesterday's close. There is an ECB press conference though tonight on monetary policy, which could cause some volatility in European and European indices and the euro. Thank you.